Okay, good morning. This time I'm going to be drawing a swordfish. So first things first, we need to draw a curve round like this. And then on top of that curve, really straight line. So that's going to be the sword part of our fish on here. Triangle here. And at the bottom of that curve, quite a, a wide triangle, wide thin triangle. You can see like that. And that's our shape so far. Then we're going to go from this point. I'm going to follow that point down. I'm going to pull it out and then to join my little curve. Just going to keep it pointed like that. And it's going to come up. I'm going to go round my fin, making that a little bit thicker. Round like that little curve at the top. And then it's going to come round. Um, now, I'm going to go in here and back out a little way. It's a little V shape for the mouth. Then they're going to follow this down to about there, like so. Then just this side of that, so I'm going to leave a little line hanging over. I'm going to pull that in to a little point in the middle of that triangle for the tail. And this is going to come up like so. Now, around about here, Gonna stick in a little uh, fin there for the fish. Let me give that a bit of a shade. Doesn't have to be very neat, just a bit darker. And then the same the opposite side, I'm gonna just curve it a little bit. Not too long. And give that a bit of a shade. And there we go. Like so. Okay. Then we need to do one little curve here and then a bigger one around like that. And then the eye is going to go here like so. So again, with those eyes, we can do a little tiny one, tiny little circle in it and colour around it for a highlight. And I'm going to do a little line underneath just to where the eye is sitting. Now this area where the gills are, they usually have a little line as well on the, that sort of follows around the back. It's like their markings like so. And last but not least, the tail. So we come from here, we go out. We're going to go up. A little bump round opposite this point. So we come up here, quite thin. And then over and back to that point. And then back up here like that. And they have quite, I'm going to make that quite a sharp little point there. And then usually we can see coming from there. Fins are quite little lines like so. And there you have your swordfish. Obviously, you can colour it as much as you like. You can shade this fin in if you wish. They usually have like darker fins than anything else. You can refine this and make it really sharp if you want. And that's your swordfish.